President Muhammad Buhari's engagement with the Nigerians in the diaspora is part of activities lined up for his first official visit to Cote d'Ivoire. Speaker after speaker at the meeting, including Nigeria's ambassador to Cote d'Ivoire, Ibrahim Issa, identified child trafficking and prostitution involving Nigerians as major issues of concern. Cote d'Ivoire has become a center for which people, young ladies, have been exported to either for prostitution or for onward movement to Europe. Every week we are always saddled with the repatriation of Nigerians. I have been seeking cooperation with the various agencies with a view to identifying those who are behind these ladies being trafficked and to be punished. At the moment we have got about two or three in prison here in Abidjan. President Buhari who also confirmed to have watched a video of some Nigerian victims narrating their horrible ordeals in Libya, described the situation as unfortunate and disturbing, while promising to ensure the return and rehabilitation of such Nigerians, the president said his administration is also committed to making Nigeria better for meaningful living by all. And we are doing our best to make sure that uh, uh, the people who are challenging the Sahara Desert and the Mediterranean there would be less of Nigerians going that way and getting perished. We are in a position by to let feed ourselves. So we are going to have food security in Nigeria earlier than anybody ever thought. So we are not doing too badly in trying to secure the country and trying to improve the economy, you know, to get jobs for people and in trying, you know, to deal with corruption. And ever uh, Nigerians are identified, especially in Libya and so on, we hope to transport them back home and rehabilitate them. The President, African Development Bank, Dr. Akimumi Adeshino, who attended the meeting, acknowledged the giant strides being recorded by the Buhari administration in the fight against insecurity and corruption, as well as revamping the economy, saying the bank will continue to chart a supportive course. That's an incredible work that you've done to bring the economy back out of recession. And also in terms of the places that Nigeria have moved up in the, uh, in the Dream Business Index. It's thanks to your leadership and your vision and commitment. And we want to, from the African Development Bank, commend you, Mr. President, and to assure you of our strong support uh, behind you and your government in all the efforts that you're trying to do uh, to move Nigeria forward. Suddenly behind you, you can count on that. It is estimated that over 1.5 million Nigerians live in Cote d'Ivoire. From Abidjan, Adamu Sambo, NTA News.